Wouldn't it be great if you could just toggle your video conference controls wirelessly without reaching for the mic button with the small cursor, or memorizing keyboard shortcuts? In this video, we are going to solve this problem with an M5 stack and some codes. Welcome back to the M5 stack workshop. We tried using the buttons, LCD, speaker, and IMU to create some simple projects in the previous videos. Feel free to check it out if you are interested. Since video calls are here to stay, we are going to learn how to create a video conference wireless control by utilizing the Bluetooth capability of the M5 stack. First, let me explain how our system works. When the user presses a button on the M5 stack, the M5 stack will send a keystroke signal to our computer via Bluetooth to toggle buttons in our video conferencing software. You could think of it as a programmable Bluetooth keyboard. We will be using the ESP32 BLE keyboard library by TVK. First, download this library to your computer. Then include it in your sketch file. Next, we will start by editing the example code provided, so copy it to your editor. Let's start by initializing the M5 stack in the setup function. Then we will write some code to send the key combination when the button on the M5 stack was pressed. The key combination here depends on the video conferencing software you are using. I'm using Zoom here, so this is the default configuration. After uploading the code to the M5 stack, let's check if it is working as expected. The quit button is not working. Let's fix that. It seems like we need to release all other buttons first before pressing enter to quit. Let's add it in our code. Let's upload and try again. Oh yeah, it works! After some final tweaking, here's the final product. You could add features you want to it, such as using the IMU sensor to control volume by tilting the device. That's all for this video, check out the other video if you are interested. See you in the next video!